Hi guys, welcome to a video, and in today's video I just wanted to do a review of the film Loving Annabelle. Now, usually I review new lesbian film releases, but I thought, you know, there's a lot of classic lesbian cinema I haven't reviewed and I just wanted to dive into the vaults and, and do just that. Just as a heads up, Loving Annabelle is a teacher-student age gap romance, so if that's not for you then farewell my fine lady. So if you're not familiar with Loving Annabelle, the film is about a girl named Annabelle who attends a Roman Catholic school. She's previously been expelled from other schools, so she's been sent to this Roman Catholic school, and it's here she meets Miss Bradley, also known as Simone, and Miss Bradley ends up being drawn to Annabelle, and as they begin to get to know one another, they grow closer and closer until they eventually collapse under the, the lesbian yearning. I have to say, this film is one of my favourites. It is a classic piece of lesbian cinema for a reason. The best thing about this film, in my opinion, is the casting behind Annabelle and Miss Bradley. The two actors really stepped up to the role and they make you believe in what you're watching. I think the relationship between Annabelle and Simone is, you know, it's intimate and it's evocative and nothing about it ever felt salacious or predatory. You really do sympathise with the characters. Also, this film is kind of famous for its song All Over You, which is a lesbian classic. The film uses Catholic iconography incredibly well and the cinematography is very powerful in this film and it is used to set the mood and it does a fantastic job. Due to the nature of Simone and Annabelle's relationship, the romance doesn't have a happy ending, however Catherine Brooks, the director, did film a alternative ending which was much more open. Also, just as a fun fact, the director actually makes a cameo in the film in the form of photographs. She's Miss Bradley's ex-girlfriend in the film. There's nothing I overtly dislike about the film. One thing that kind of not gets on my nerves but it stands out to me, is the actor who plays Kat, one of Annabelle's friends, looks about 40 years old and I'm supposed to believe that she's in high school or she's a schoolgirl. It kind of just looked a little bit ridiculous. Kat is a very cliche character and she doesn't have the best dialogue and I know she's supposed to be the film's antagonist but if almost felt like she was a caricature of an antagonist. I don't know, I just, yeah. Overall, the film really is worth watching. It is a lesbian classic for a reason, and the best thing about this film is that it's believable. The actors do such an incredible job that you completely believe what you're watching, and yeah, I think the film is special. Okay guys, if you've seen the film, let me know what you think of it in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe for Instant Disappointment, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.